Welcome to FRL Farming News and we're here at the Dairy Show in the Bath and West Showground. Ian, a fantastic venue and, and again a, an amazing stand. Baz, technology wise from, from Leeloy Innovators, some 20 years on, you guys have really seen some changes within the dairy industry. Come on, explain what, what's been happening just recently. Well, a bit, probably the biggest change in the industry at the moment is labour. And with that, the technology we've got now is saving actually farmers labour time. Yeah. And with that, they can get more information. So this is helping them to actually progress with their dairy units and make them efficient, labour efficiencies. I mean, come on, we're, we're age, age-wise, are we starting to now see this new generation that, that really are smartphone, PC, that that's, that's where their businesses are going? Are we seeing a, a, an increase from that side of things? For, for, you know, Baz, what do you see a big increase because like three weeks ago we launched our new app to help the farmers to manage their cows differently. It will help them to see where uh, people are going on on their day-to-day basis, what jobs have been done to actually help the, the farmer to manage the cows better, get more out of his day and be more efficient because efficiency in a way is key to, to making more money in, in business. I mean, exactly. Ian, I mean, come on, look at the farm behind us. How, how, how long ago was this system put in? For this particular herd here, it was seven years ago. So Alan's been working for seven years now, and well, obviously things are going really, really well on the farm. And with that, he's on about talking now to putting in the third machine because it's helping him to actually progress, earning more incomes, seeing less labour. That's, that's fascinating, isn't it? You know, seven years, who would, have, who would have thought it seven years ago? I mean, certainly when you guys brought this into the industry some 20 years ago, it was a bit like the mobile phone. This will never take off. You know, here we are now. It's a, an absolute hot topic, isn't it? It's so efficient. You can manage what you're doing. It really is the next generation for dairy, isn't it? Oh yeah, totally. Yeah. It's a. It's, well, every year it's something's changing and evolving and moving forward, and that's uh, the big thing with it. So. I mean, Brad. I mean, there you are from the technical perspective, travelling up and down the country. Um, are we seeing a marked? increase in inquiries and sales? We see a lot of increase, especially like shows like today. From There's a lot of people coming to see how it can work in practice. And more and more people are now looking into technology because labor is getting scarce. They're looking at automation to help them out to, to kind of, in a way, get, get it going. I mean, that, that's, a good, that's a good point, that Ian, isn't it? You know, labour's getting scarce. Yeah. You know, we, we've read it time and time again, less and less people coming into farming. Well, if we've got less people coming into farming and you chaps are producing such fantastic equipment like this, there, there is a breath of fresh air for farming, isn't there, really? There certainly is. And the younger generation, you know, most of them don't want to work the long hours now, what you're finding out. So this actually lets them actually let the cows do the work for them and they actually manage the cows. So they're working more much sociable hours, if you can I think that's the key to it, isn't it? All of a sudden we're getting quality time back into the farming perspective, isn't yeah. it? For the general public, they've still got this persona of, you know, we milk in the mornings and we milk in the evenings. This is not the case anymore, is it? These units are working 24-7, aren't they? 365 days of the year. Yeah, correct. They keep going. And also what we have seen now is also you get a lot more also people that have retired from farming um, now actually looking into coming back in again. We see also that the next generation could be the right. beef farmer, the circular farmer that actually is going into dairy. I mean, gentlemen, it's, it's been absolutely fascinating. And I know there's so many people behind us, and I know you've got to go away. Thanks very much indeed for just spending a bit of time. Um, like I say, innovators, well, you were the first guys to produce these units. It, it's been a fascinating story. Thanks very much indeed for your time.